I mean, they're still, like, they're not great. Not the worst I've seen, but by no means the best. And I believe you... Oh, you just gave us three units here. You know what? I'm going to keep these guys around. Because we kind of have to. Just put them over here for the time being. Invade Argentina when we have to. But it does mean I probably need to get rid of another army. And actually, if this is all cores, we don't need you. As far as I'm concerned. Just get rid of you. I'm going to get rid of another nine army here. For 231. Yeah, 5.9% is too much. We need, it, we need it to be under uh, 4 until we get radio. Radio will make us um, more viable in killing people. But until then, we're going to have an issue. Okay, infrastructure is going to be done. I wouldn't actually mind getting... That can be two civilian factories. Uh, research. You'll be done in 77 days. 68 out of 31. 5.9%. I'm going to delete half of this backup army. 1.8. Okay. Now our units will be performing better. We probably want to maybe like sneak our way over to... Um, sneak our way over to uh, ba -da -ba 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 Petrograd when we can. I mean, the Germans are dug in. There's no doubt about that, but by golly, Santa Claus is coming to town. And he's going to kill all of you. Okay, we got a breakthrough right in the middle. He's got a lot of defense. You know, we, we can't ignore his defensive powers, but we've now broken through. We can probably get a double encirclement uh, doing something like this. Yeah, so you're now worth everybody. You guys can have a fun time with that. Kiel has now been basically completely encircled. Uh, we'll soon have Hamburg and this other province encircled as well. And it's all looking pretty good. Again, we're losing a lot of supplies due to... Um, but we don't have a navy. Which, I mean, is an issue. Don't get me wrong. That's also a lot of Russian troops that trapped. 20... Like, Russia doesn't have an army anymore. I honestly think that this might be the entirety of the Russian army right here. They're not having a great day. Also, they once again tried to invade uh, Stockholm. Clearly did not work. The Oriat Kingdom. Okay. I mean, actually, let's look at some ideologies. Anybody doing anything a little bit funky? The answer is like, I don't really think so. Y'all seem to be pretty, pretty normal. But now that we've broken through Kiel and our front lines are going to be uh, blowing up here. We're going to be looking absolutely fantastic. Oh, so apparently there's nobody on this naval, or there's nobody on this invasion order. There you go. Figure that one out. 53 days till radio's done. Or 53 days till our research upgrade is done. And after that, we can go straight into um, the radio research. We're just now we do do want. Yeah, <laughs> do do. Okay, but now that we've broken our way through Russia like this, yeah, Russia is completely, completely screwed. Romania joined the Belgrade Pact. So they will win their war down there soon enough. Yeah, and I don't, I don't think Germany is really going to stand a chance. We got another invasion. They've landed a single unit. Congratulations, Russia. He's now just going to die, so I don't know... If that was really worth it for you? Put purple on this line. And have you go down towards White Ruthenia like this. Seems good enough to me. And what do we got? We got another uh, land doctrine. Keep on going to certain mass assault because it makes perfect sense for what we're doing here. Yeah, I mean, we just outnumber Russia at this point. Is Transmitter losing their war? They actually are losing their war, which is hilarious. Good work there, guys. People Zardom. What is going on in Kaiser, <laughs> Kaiser Redux? Oh, it's a wild time. Just giving me more convoys then for right now. 
going to cut down you a little bit. Because, again, I do want to get our aircraft at least somewhat operational. Apparently, Hamburg still hasn't fallen. And I think all these guys, they really should just be on as aggressive as they possibly can. What do you got? Offensive Doctrine? Yes, please. Reinforcement rate plus 2%. That actually makes a massive difference here. I would like to promote somebody else, but it's going to be very, very expensive. Thank you for the reinforcement rate. It'll now make this debuff a little bit less bad. What is going on with this line? Oh, what are you, why are you... No, 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 no. Be right here. And then push like this. And a simple, simple job. Love we'll one guy go down like that, and that should be okay. But yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the entirety of the Russian army right here, and there's like 15 dudes. So I'm not worried about it. And again, just like I'm not really worried about what's going on in, uh, in Germany either. Berlin's about to fall to Santa. Advancing Empire of Santa's troops after long, merciless fighting. Santa has captured Berlin. And, he, and he's loving it. So we've got... Oh, we've got some troops in Gotland. I'm, for the moment, I'm going to disband you. I know once we get more... Um, I see 252. We probably, we probably could maybe get one more unit. Or 256. They should uh, update in a moment. We can probably afford more units sooner rather than later. Delete, delete, uh, delete, and then delete that. I almost kind of feel bad for Russia, but at the same time, I freaking hate um, going to war with Russia. So you know what? This is actually a little bit cathartic. I'm, I'm having a great time. Just kicking the shit out of them. And yeah, we're still technically at war with uh, Argentina. We will be at war uh, Chile and uh, Patagonia, but at some point we'll be at war with you as well. And I believe our Santa troop there should do all right. Okay, keep stop putting troops over here. Okay. Yeah, we'll just have this like that. That should fix that issue. Stop putting troops on Finland. We might go. In, we might actually go to war. Oh, hi, hello, Russia. For some reason I didn't expect you to be there. We, we can go just bring troops down there though, and uh. Crush them ra rather easily. And we're probably going to see the collapse of the Reichspact event fire rather soon. Have we killed any Ukrainian... No, we actually haven't. We're not even at war with uh, Middle Africa's puppet nations. At least not right yet. I know, it'll go on YouTube eventually. It'll, I think it'll, it'll start going up on YouTube on Monday. So if you miss it here, it's not a... Uh... You're not going to, you know, miss out on it forever. Empire of Santa grows. We love old Jolly Saint Nick. Capture this, capture that. Give me more infrastructure. We're way towards Leipzig. How much does Germany have? Germany has an army of 73 to 120, which is less men than I think I have on their border. But these guys right here, I'm actually going to have them march straight over to uh, Lithuania. Just make sure that they don't get out of this. Also, are you... So they're social democrats right now, okay. Hello, Q Fabus. Welcome, welcome. Four vehicles declared independence. What's going on over here? Pacific States and American and USA has decided not to be at war. What's going on? Santa's kicking everybody's ass. That's what's going on. He's having a great day. I need to put these units anywhere else. Again, I don't think so. Uh, again, we're, we're, we're mostly doing fine. You can see what I'm saying here. Apparently, Portugal's... Oh, Portugal's at war in Middle Africa. Santa's not real. Um, uh, see, that that's the thing. Wait, we might need to ban you for that. <laughs> 
See, this is why Santa's going to war with everybody, because people have lost the Christmas spirit. And now millions of people need to die. It's all your fault, you Fabus. If you just believed, there'd be millions more um, Russian and German people alive right now. How many Russians have we killed so far? 671,000? Yeah, that's quite a bit. Christmas is about giving, not receiving. I'm giving them bombs. I'm, g I'm giving them uh, an early retirement. Again, go on the finish border. Don't be down here. Delete you. And then, yeah, you can be down here. We haven't taken any major Russian cities yet, but we're, we're going to be there rather soon. And, yeah, Purple Army, your job right now, honestly, is just, hey, march your way uh, this way. And please do that ASAP. Again, in 60 days, we should be going to war with another person. I'm not too sure when that will be. Okay, I will admit, the Germans are putting up a little bit more of a fight now. I'm going to bring Purple Army. You're going to go right on this border, and your job is just going to be push, hey, push your way into Lithuania. I already forgot which army you are. You're this guy? Yeah. And just be very, very aggressive about it. You should have an okay time. Petrograd, please take that city. Well, again, we're not at War of Finland yet, but I, Finland's going to be a very easy conquest, so I'm not too worried about it. I would, I do wish that the Germans would stop blowing up all of my convoys. Like, that would actually be, like, really nice. But there's, like, nothing I can actually do about it. I don't have any, um... I don't have a navy. Unsurprisingly, Santa never realized that boats existed. So... I'm gonna go up and around, capture these major cities. Oh, look at this guy. This guy knows what's up. Go to Munich. This is not gonna trigger the um, Austria joining the war, right? I don't actually know. I mean, no, it, it shouldn't. I think it's only if Russia and uh, France do anything. Not when um, any other country invades Germany. At least I'm pretty sure. I might, I might be completely wrong on that. Have we killed any non-German troop? We've killed a little bit of units from uh, Middle Africa, but that's basically it. Also, I am just going to clear war on every other... Uh, every one of their puppet states. I think that should be all of them, right? Yes. Okay. Now, all of Middle Africa is involved, as they should be. Okay, we almost have a small pocket here. Take in Brazil. Let's go down to Hindenburg and then down to uh, Katowice. Because, yeah, you're a basic republic. You are in the Internationale. Which means that a war... Oh, now we're at War of Finland. Okay, excellent. Finally! The War of Finland has begun. Also, wait, are you... No, you're at war with Germany. I thought I said the Philippines joined the Reich's Pact. But it's literally quite the opposite. Okay, so Germany's down to 39%. So we should be seeing... Oh, you... Okay. Thanks for all the events on troops. I'm glad to have them here, but I also don't want them. Just because up there, they're not really doing anything for us. By the way, how is Germany... I guess they're sending troops probably from Danzig? Where's where's their navy coming from? Yeah, German submarines are just being a pain in the ass. Blowing up literally everything I've ever had. And I consider that to be very, very, very rude. I would like to get some more commanders, though. Welcome, Peter Roberts. That's a very Polar Bear-esque name. But you guys don't even have a battle plan. Yeah, so do this. I see, no, all of you should be on that battle plan. Delete this for the time being. And just push away through Russia. Right now, Russia is at capitulation of 83%. We'll be, that's probably because we taken Petrograd, Moscow, or Volgograd yet. Most of the major cities. Okay, Belgium has joined the war. Not that I'm really too concerned about it. I'm not going to take a non-aggression pact. Are you kidding me? 
I'm, I'm coming for you too, Philippines. Don't you think I'm not on my way? Because I will crush you. How are you guys not dead, by the way? I really feel like the Germans at this point should be dead. But they're just being a little bit stubborn. But maybe we can capture some aircraft. I think we have like a handful built, but not too many. This way, but nobody believes in him. Don't be mean to Santa Claus. Santa's right now. Santa's fighting for your freedom. Okay, Germany. Again, you need to be at. You actually have forty-six. If you capture a city. Have you captured a victory point back? Oh yeah, they probably took like Essen back, I think. This is the best timeline. This is the only timeline. This is the, this is your future. This is all of our future. If you don't start putting some respect on his name. Santa Claus is coming to town. It's not it's not like a it's not a you know happy go lucky song. It's a it's an active threat. Probably don't need these units here anymore. I don't think Rush is going to do anything to stop us. We're going to put these guys on this border. Your job is to be pushed your way into Belgium. And begin the invasion there ASAP. Yeah, Germany once again at 39%. The Empire of Santa is looking pretty good. Nobody messing with Santa Claus right now. We still have not taken Petrograd, surprisingly enough. Sublime Ottoman uh, Federation. That's nice of them. I don't know where you're going. Go to Kursk, I guess, and go to these other cities. Oh, no, no. Go to, go to Kiev. Maybe that'll do something for us. I don't know. 92. Come on. Just get a little bit more damage. You're done. Taken S in Dusseldorf Cologne. We've taken Dortmund. Munich's a little bit far away, but we'll get there soon enough, I'm sure. How are you guys still alive? Yeah, there you go. You've realized that you should surrender. You guys go to Vilnius. How many men do we have on this line? Seven? Seven's reasonable. And we now. Oh, there's a class of the Reichs Pact. Well, it was nice knowing you, Germany. Wait, who are we still at war with? We're still at war with a couple of, um... Yeah, with you. But just like the puppet states, surprisingly enough. I mean, I, I mean, it still works out. But now we have so many countries that we border that we could be at war with. Russia, Patagonia, Nigeria, Congo. There we go. Sorry, Germany. I'm gonna take all your stuff. Thank you, thank you. But now you gotta prepare these units to uh, engage in future operations. So we'll put you on this border here. Prepare to invade your way into Austria. Not all of you, though. This 12 stack ready to go into Belgium. This army ready to go their way into France. You, 18 divisions, ready to go into Bohemia. Who else do we got? We got 19 up in the north. We're gonna bring you down to be the anti-Polish army. 48, yeah, you're, you're just waiting for your future orders. And then this 24 stack. Um, For right now, go on the Dutch border, because I don't know where else to really put you at the moment. Give me more factories. And now, assuming you probably like more planes, right? Yeah, we captured a lot of. I was gonna say we captured a lot of aircraft from uh, Germany. No, we didn't. Not even remotely, actually. But Germany is dead. And you are not the exiled German Empire. So yeah, let me just double check. You can't demand Alsace Lorraine anymore, right? Because it's not owned by Germany. Yeah, it's very weird. It should just declare war on whoever holds that territory. Instead of just being, um... 
there any more, is there any more troops up here that we can have? I mean, eventually we'll be able to move the, um, the Finnish army down south. How close is Russia to being dead? Oh, we're still 47%. Even when Russia doesn't have an army and Santa Claus is just marching his way through the country, they're still too powerful. And you're all, you should become cores, I believe, soon. I'm not too sure exactly how the event works. No, keep, no, they, they can't have independence. Are you kidding me? Are you fools? Thank you for your equipment. One. Follow that up with support weapons. Because it's only 1937. Santa murdered Kaiser so fast he couldn't escape to, uh, to Africa. Exactly. Santa Rice Legacy of the North Pole. 